Well, the White House was asked for a reaction today to the Supreme Court's taking up of the Mississippi abortion case. Press Secretary Jen Psaki says abortion has been under relentless assault and that the Biden-Harris administration wants to make sure Roe v. Wade does not disappear. White House correspondent Owen Jensen reports. Owen. Tracy, good evening to you. Press Secretary Jen Psaki did not speak specifically to the Mississippi case, but was unequivocal on where the Biden administration stands on abortion or what some abortion proponents refer to as, quote, reproductive health care. The president is committed to codifying Roe. The White House press secretary reconfirms the administration's strong backing of abortion. Over the last four years, uh, critical rights, like the right to health care, the right to choose, have been under withering and extreme attack, including through draconian state laws. And she said the president and vice president are devoted to ensuring that every American has access to health care, including reproductive health care, regardless of their income, zip code, race, health insurance status, or immigration status. Also today, President Joe Biden updates the nation on the coronavirus. Pandemic cases are down in all 50 states. Just last week, the CDC announced Americans who are fully vaccinated can ditch the mask. Some people may want to continue to wear masks, even if they are fully vaccinated. That's a decision they can make. Former U.S. Surgeon General Jerome Adams said based on the science, it was the appropriate call by the CDC, but added that it caused a case of whiplash for the American public and was not communicated well. I think that uh, the play call was right, but they fumbled the ball at the one yard line in terms of uh, communicating this to the public in terms of engagement. Public health officials, he says, did not see it coming. They are upset. They were blindsided by this new information. I think you missed the nuance about protecting yourself versus protecting an organization. Know that your tax cut is coming. Also today, the Biden administration announces that under the American Rescue Plan, with the expanded child tax credit, millions of families will start getting checks this summer, as much as 300 bucks per month per child. Now, back to the pandemic for a moment. The president also said in his speech today that going forward, there will be advances as well as setbacks, and that those who are not vaccinated will end up paying the price. And he promised that in the coming weeks, the U.S. will send millions of vaccines overseas. At the White House, Owen Jensen, EWTN News Nightly.